can dissolve partially and C can dissolve. Under B, isolating linear, impopo uniform, so on. Under B, lack of immunity in our main, not making its full recommend, so on. Under C, we can study lack of science lab, lack of library, and rest of other you can see in the slide. After that, we are done selling some of the major tokens from A group, and some of them are isolating linear, impopo uniform. This is the lady. Irregular in class. This is our school properties. Incomplete assignment. And rest of other you can see in the slide. Here we have done pair ranking on temperature problems and the sample of pair ranking you can see on the slide. This is the composite of pair ranking and the data you can see on the slide. <coughs> According to our pair ranking, we came to know that improper uniform is our main problem with 35 points. Okay, straight on, improper uniform. In this slide, we have tried to define our main problem. Improper uniform is the problem with decreased identity as well as the quality of the skin and strain. It also involves the student personality which directly affects the school environment. Improper uniform means the condition in which student wearing uniform would care less case. After that, after selecting the main problem of the school, the following points as our objective to make our school environment good, to make students more responsible, to maintain discipline among students, to maintain sanitation among students, to make the culture of school. This is how we collect our data regarding student uniform. Miss Prasanth Sam went to LK Gen 5, Mr. Subhas went to 678. Ms. Asmina went to 2 hj 4 and myself Raymond Gurum went to nursery 9 and 10. Ms. Osan went to UKGM1, Ms. Manju went to 2B3B4B. Our data collection was completed by two steps and first we collected the data regarding house stress and second we collected the data regarding regular school uniform. And according to our data we came to know that around 1.8 students are improper during house stress and around 19 students are improper regarding their regular school uniform. After that, we have the target city. The concentration of the students who are improper in house stress were 148 and we are targeting to degrees up to 70. And the concentration of the students who are improper in neighborhood school uniform were 92 and we are targeting to degrees up to 40. This is a graphical illustration of the target city, let it get some inside. These are the dates of initial observation, which are in the illegal uniform, let it get some inside. These are also needs of initial observation during during house race that you can see in this slide. The uniform which we are currently wearing is our regular school uniform. And the uniform which you can see that Mr. Raymond Gwen is wearing is our house dress, which we wear 4 days in a week. And the regular uniform which we wear 4 days in a week. So we decided to separately analyze the condition of our regular school uniform and house dress. Here we have prepared a chart according to the data of our check sheet and according to it, 70% of the total students are improper regarding their uniform and remaining 30% of the students are proper regarding their uniform. These are the some effects of the problems which can be seen on the school and the students and they are it decreases the quality of school, it decreases the percentage of students, it makes the irresponsible, it decreases the thing of the strength. This is Ishikawa diagram which is also known as cause and effect diagram. It helps to find out the causes of our main problem and these four factors are causing our main problem. They are self, school, seniors and family, under self, lack of self-awareness, laziness, show behavior, discipline problems, under school, no regular supervision, not counseling to the students, no rules and regulations, under seniors, influencing the juniors and under family, not responsible towards children. After the Pisman diagram, we are starting to find the causes in ABC group as you can see in the slide. These are the list of A group causes and they are lack of self awareness, laziness, soft behavior, no regular supervision. After that, we have done the wave analysis of A group causes to find out the main root cause and our first cause is lack of self awareness. Why lack of self awareness? No counseling from seniors. Why no counseling from seniors? Less interaction between juniors and seniors. Why less interaction between seniors and seniors? Lack of responsiveness and it is the root cause of lack of self awareness. Now, second cause is laziness. Why laziness? Lack of self-interest. Why lack of self-interest? No goals. Why no goals? Procrastinating behavior and it's the root cause of laziness. Now, third cause is swap behavior. Why swap behavior? Superiority complex. Why superiority complex? First imitation of Western culture. Why false imitation of Western culture? Misuse of social media. Why misuse of social media? Lack of counseling and it is the root cause of swap behavior. <coughs> now, fourth cause is no regular supervision. Why no regular supervision? Too much student to handle. Why too much student to handle? No objective. Why no division? Passing monitor and any digital root cause of no regular supervision. After the viral analysis, these are the list of root causes. They are 
Lack of responsiveness in seniors. Procrastinating behavior in students. Lack of counseling. Passive monitoring. After that, we are done member voting on four root causes. The data you can see on the slide. According to our ranking, we came to know that lack of counseling is our main root cause with total movement points. For now, we have decided to solve our main problem. Taking these two root causes, they are lack of counseling, procrastinating behavior in students. And here we have prepared a pie chart. Fabdabul Mahan Chana, our main root cause of counseling. In this, Fabdabul means what, why, who, where, when, and what is mean how. And we have planned to conduct motivation and counseling class for students. Why? To make students more active in their work. Who? We, a member of United Student College Circle. Where? School from the size. Where? 2020 AD, August 8th, 11. Uh -huh. uh, by conducting motivation class for students with the help of administration doing frequent counseling to the under student. This is the means of introducing phase 1, where we provided motivation and counseling class to every student from 1 to 10. Where we told them about the importance of proper uniform and, and effects of improper uniform on student. These are also the glimpses of information phase 1. Let you can see in this slide. So in these two side of pictures, we could not show all the activities done by our circle during our implementation phase 1. Frequent counseling was given to the undressed student and time to time motivation classes conducted to the students. And these are some of the results which we got after our implementation phase 1 and they are Maximum number of students each time to wear regular school uniform. A student failed their responsibility of being student. The student started to follow the rules and regulations of school. The students had to wear a clean sound there. The student will avoid the guys' daily uniform situation. After that, we will have five double one other arms. Our second root cause is procrastinating behavior. Why? Writing a letter to an administration. Why? To be focusing on behavior the student. Who? Who is a member of my distant body circle? Where? Where? School to size. Where? Where? 2022 September 11. How? How? Proposing letter to our administration to mediate the supply of the supply of stress in time. Actually, according to our survey, we came to know that procrastinating of behavior on the student was not their habit. To where our stress was not their habit. But they were compared or they were making an issue saying that there is no perfect size of stress available on the school stationery. So, we wrote a letter to our principal sir to mediate a supplier to supply a perfect size of stress in time. These are the glimpses of implementation phase 2, where we conduct a meeting with the administration and where we provide a proposal letter to our principal sir to mediate a supplier to supply a sufficient amount of stress in time. This is also the glimpse of implementation phase 2, which you can see in the slide. Our implementation phase 1 was all about our regular school uniform and our implementation phase 2 was about our stress problem and these are the some results that we get after the implementation phase 2 and there, there was the proper supply of stress from the supplier. Students started to wear stress properly. Did you mean the procrastinating behavior of students? The student became active and responsible towards the uniform. This is the data of our final observation and according to our final observation, we came to know that around 76 students are improper during our house race and around 38 students are improper during the regular school uniform. This slide shows the comparison between the final observation and target. According to our final observation, we came to know that around 76 students are improper during the house race but our target was to decrease up to 70. And around 38 students are improper during the regular school uniform, and our target was to decrease up to 14. These are the glimpses of final of the person, student during regular uniform, which you can see on the slide. These are also the glimpses of final of the person, student during house dress, which you can see on the slide. And here we have prepared a chart according to the data of the final observation of six seats. And according to it, we came to know that around 33.50% of the students are proper improper regarding the uniform and around 66.50% of the students are proper regarding the uniform. This is the comparison between final observation and initial observation, which you can see beside. After involving SUC, these are the benefits of circle. They are learn to do case study about different problems. Learn to work in a team. Learn to face and solve problem effectively. Build up our confidence in creative thinking. Build up our confidence to solve the problem. <laughs> These are our future plans, and some of them are conduct other more programs to solve the problems related to the students' uniform. To minimize the uniform problem of the student and maintain cleanliness among them. Analyze the more problems of our school and solve them. To formulate other more qualities of our school and guide them. 
These are the obstacles faced by us while doing our case study and they are lack of cooperation from students, lack of time for conducting program to solve problem, irregularity of members in practice, curricular tester by parents and teachers. Our sincere thanks goes to all the teaching and non-teaching staff of our school. Master Chidam Mr. Omi Kamlimba. Vice Principal Mr. Dr. Prasad Adhikari. President Mr. Sumit Lugukar. All the students of our school. And all the viewers present here. Thank, Thank you. you. Excuse me, I'm excuse me. 